Lyle, I'm going to tell you something. If some pharmaceutical company had been able to isolate niacin and get a patent on it so that, that, so that only that company was able to sell it, it would be the top selling pharmaceutical product in the world. And probably the safest. And absolutely the safest and with the longest track record because no pharmaceutical agent for lowering cholesterol has the benefits that you find in niacin. You get the lowering of the bad LDL, the raising of the HDL, the lowering of triglycerides, the lowering of the LP little a we talked about. There is also a lowering of what's called fibrinogen that affects the clotting yes. of the blood yes. in the body. And on a very arcane chemical level, there are uh, two substances called prostaglandins. One is uh, prostacycline, uh, which we want more of in the body and less of the thromboxane. So we want to keep these in balance, and the niacin is the only agent known to do that. Actually, the LP little a that I referred to, that lipoprotein A, the variant of LDL, it is an independent risk factor. Sometimes people will have a perfectly normal cholesterol level and have ele elevations of the LP little a. Niacin is the only agent in the entire world that'll do it. Now, no statin drug can do what niacin does. It's, it has the best total effects across the whole spectrum of what's called the lipid profile. No pharmaceutical agent, no prescription drug can possibly compare with niacin. And indeed, research is now showing that uh, for those really tough cases of people who have elevations of 300, 350, I mean, really high cholesterol, and who have had multiple heart attacks and bypass surgery, that the ultimate is to combine a very low dose of the statin drug with niacin. It's the ultimate, and as I said earlier, I truly believe it's the agent that saved my life. Well, that's terrific. Now we can get it down and keep it down, and hopefully we can pay attention to a lot of other things that we need to do in our lives and not have to worry about our cholesterol. Absolutely. Thank you, Robert. Yes, sir.